Hi there, this is Ranjit and in this uh, video we'll be doing the unboxing and we'll have a first look at this Oppo A57 which Oppo is sort of marketing as a mid-range uh, smartphone and the speciality of this uh, smartphone is that it is having a 16 megapixel uh, front facing camera as you can see 16 megapixel front facing camera whereas the rear facing camera is just a 13 megapixel uh, shooter and it just says uh, Qualcomm octa-core uh, it is having a Qualcomm Snapdragon 435 uh, chipset and quite a few have asked me to uh, test this out so I just purchased this and regarding the pricing the price quoted on the box is 15,999 but it's available online uh, for about 15,000 in online stores uh, but I purchased this one from a local store here in Hyderabad that's Faisal Communications and as I know them they gave me this for just about 14,400 so if you're in the market just shop around you can get some discount instead of buying it strangely this is expensive online than in offline stores so let's just uh, open this up let me just break the seals and let's have a look at this device uh, regarding the specs general specs uh, uh, it's not very highly specced up device guys uh, in fact uh, the strange thing is that uh, if you look at the screen uh, the screen is just a uh, 720p HD screen and considering the price point I feel uh, that's not that great but uh, let's look at the device itself uh, the packaging looks nice it says oppo so we have the handset itself and i checked in the local store also they just had this one color this is this white and gold or what they like to call it so this is the color that uh, was just available so i just got this one and let's just open this up uh, the build quality initial impressions it has a slight heft towards it and this is having a 5.2 inch screen we'll look at the phone later on let's see what else do we get in the box so we just open this up and some paperwork and uh, we get a silicon uh, rubber case so that is bundled and quite a bit of uh, uh, paperwork that we have on this one so that's what we get and we also get a headset so that's nice uh, they are bundling a headset a USB cable that we are going to get and uh, let's look at the power adapter Oppo branded the one that we are getting and uh, it says uh, it's not a fast charger guys the max output is just one point uh, uh it's five volts at just one amp so it's not even a two amp charger so it's not going to charge it quickly and the battery capacity is also not very high but again it's just having a 720p hd screen it's uh as far as i recall this one has just a what do you say uh 2900 milliamp power battery let me just actually uh show you the device itself now and uh looks like we have we have a screen guard that is uh, pre-applied nowhere on the box it's uh, written what type of glass protection we have so not sure but a screen guard was actually pre-applied uh, to this device and uh, again it's a dual sim uh, device hybrid just gives an idea about that uh, here on the back and uh, let me give you a physical overview first on the top surprisingly we have uh, nothing guys as you can see and uh, the sim tray is over here and the power on off button is here uh, the build quality seems to be nice and on the bottom one speaker a micro usb port and a microphone and 3.5 mm headphone jack so most of the stuff is here at the bottom for this device and we on this end we just have the volume rockers so let's just uh, and uh, this is the uh, home button it's not a button it's like on what we found on the one plus three and the one plus three t and the fingerprint uh, sensor is sort of embedded on this one itself so let's uh, uh, actually boot this up and by the time it actually uh, boots up and i set this up let me give you a configuration overview this Oppo A57 is powered by the Snapdragon 435 chipset which is an octa-core processor based on the ARM Cortex A53. It comes with 3GB of RAM, 32GB of internal storage. Moving to the screen, it has a 5.2 inch 720p IPS grade screen. It has a 13MP rear-facing camera with f2.2 lens and a front-facing 16MP camera with f2.0 lens. It also has FM radio support, it has a 2900mAh battery and it also has a fingerprint scanner. So we have just uh, finished uh, setting up this uh, device itself and again it's running on the custom UI that is known as Color OS that Oppo uses and uh, it's like many of the other Chinese vendors you don't have a app tray so your, all your apps will reside here but uh, they do have folders so you can put uh, it back on the 
uh, folder. And uh, we have the multitasking uh, tray over here. As you can see, no recent as this is the home button and this is the back. And uh, again, if you go to tools, uh, we have compass support and we also have FM radio support on this device. Let's just uh, go back here. And if you pull down, these are the quick uh, toggles that uh, you see on the device. And this is the brightness setting. And uh, so notifications, let's look at the settings. And if we go to, uh, let's just go back about the device i want to see which android version it comes with again this is a new type of uh, uh, ui that we have uh, it's a little bit different i would say if you go to about the phone it's running on the android version 6.0.1 so as is a custom ui uh, regarding android uh, no got update uh, i'm not very sure when it'll get uh, generally that's the problem with these uh, what do you say custom uh, UI and stuff. So by the way, it's running on 6.0.1. And out of that 32 gigabytes, uh, you get about 22 gigabytes of space available for you. And as you can see, we have three gigabytes of RAM. So let's just uh, go back. Uh, so uh, before we proceed, let's also look at the uh, fingerprint sensor. And I just tap, it uh, seems to work very quickly as you can see. So indeed, very quick uh, fingerprint scanner. As you can see, the moment you touch on it, uh, it does work working just like the OnePlus uh, uh, 3 all, that also had a very fast fingerprint scanner. But now let's look at the camera because that's the thing that Oppo is marketing this phone as as a camera smartphone. So let's look at it. Uh, let's just agree. So this is the default mode. We have photo, uh, video and time lapse option. So let's uh, go to the photo mode and uh, if we click here so we have the gift mode and we also have expert mode so that's nice to see but let's uh, take some uh, quick snaps uh, here so the shutter speed is quick as you can see really quick in fact let me just go there but again the lighting is good over here so as you can see it, uh, these snaps uh, look good uh, but again the highlighting point of this device is the selfie camera that's a 16 megapixel shooter so here are some of the sample shots uh, with the selfie camera. So guys, that's it for now for this uh, unboxing and first look at this Oppo A57. So what do you think about this device at the price point of about 14,500 to 15,000 guys? And again, as Oppo is stressing, the camera is the highlighting point. So I'll definitely uh, test out the camera performance of uh, this device. And maybe if you guys want, I can compare the camera performance with the Honor 6X because the pricing of the Honor 6X is also very close to this A57. So do let me know in the YouTube comments below. So guys, that's it for now for this unboxing. And if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.